さあ始めよう貴様正気か隊長の件でアムレートの何か分かったのですかGod, I forgot where we left. Oh, right, yeah, last time I was just. <laughs> you <laughs> bummed around. We, we, well, I wouldn't say bummed around. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the first step is, is, is realizing it and coming to terms. Yeah. <laughs> I forgot I totally, I totally trampled over Brunhild. With, Did you? Uh, yeah. With,、uh, you know, just mashing, mashing the menu button and、oh, then、yeah. uh, uh, pressing、uh, Splash Squall or whatever that move was. Okay, fine.、Uh, let's go to. Let's do my favorite thing. Okay. Let's just get out of the way. Yeah, just to get it out of the way. <laughs> no, I love doing like weird movement or menu stuff.、Oh, yeah, you you. It's just fascinating to me. Again, you do you. <laughs> I'll do what normal people don't do. I'm joking! I'm joking! <laughs> okay, what, what, are, what are we. Oh, yeah, that's right. I talked to. <sighs> I did the stupidest thing ever. Right. What?、Uh, remember, I had to talk to one of, one of the Circle of Five.、Oh, no, yeah. I had to go to the headquarters, talk to the Circle of Five, and now go back to the headquarters. <laughs> yeah, I remember that. That was so stupid. Okay.、Uh, how do, you know, how do I. I'm not going to spend that. Ooh, okay. Boo.、Mm, right, I probably should fix that later. Yeah. The Uh, how, do I, how do I open the thing? What? Why、oh, you s c a r e me? You look like you're not yet if you froze.、Hmm. I'm trying to open up that menu that opens up the where to go. The... You got to. You got already? There, there are things in my head where I wish it was in place and I assumed it was real. And that was one of them. I, I know Santa's real. You can't lie to me. Shut up, Santa's real. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I think we need, after this, we need to have to sit down. We are sitting down. <laughs> given away that the from the mics and,、uh, and away from. Yeah.、Uh, let's see. Given that the anti、uh, Jitlet survival of the brass has already backed this idea in full, I will gladly lend a hand myself. Though I can't help but n o t e <coughs> Mr. Sabanachi's influence is rather impressive. Yes, his technology, blah 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 blah.、Uh, some things just don't make sense, but I'll go with it anyways because it's not in my character to even judge. Blah 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 blah. I just followed the princess blindly. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty much what he said. Thank you, Kim Lamar. Let's see. God damn, this is the most corniest. Oh my god. That's it? Shit. Yes, it is. Yes, it is.、Uh, exchange? How much do I have? 140?、Mm. You can、uh, buy. Nah, nothing. I just wanted to know why stuff. Okay, so we. The free battle, free battle. Hmm, do we want to do free battles or do we just want to go straight to the story? Uh. Hmm. I don't want to see story, but I don't want you to. Wait, hold on. Oh, it requires level 8? That's nothing. We're already level 10. Sorry.、Oh, really? Yeah. Oh.、Uh, can I check it out over? Oh my god. Okay, here. Let me, let me just show you very quickly. Unless the system won't let me do it unless I'm out in the town. Okay. Yeah, we're level 13. Shit. Okay. Well. Time to, uh. Time to go、uh, get back mom. Or whatever.、Mm. Yay! Complete Basil's request? Yes! Wait, that's it?、Uh, a... This is the training ground! I have a special assignment for you. As per Mr. Sabanachi,、oh, uh, okay. uh, his request, you will test your newly upgraded anti Valkyria weapon here. Exosuits? No. Oh. Fancier swords? Probably. Probably, yeah.、Uh, it's probably just more Final Fantasy VII stuff. I love how it's just like the anti Valkyria squad. So it means they set up the anti Valkyria squad, gave you Ragnar weapons, 
and then you meet a Valkyria and they're like, oh, we are actually not separate. I, I thought this is the anti Valkyria spawn. <laughs> you know, you, we thought, you know, I thought we were ready already. But I guess not. Yeah, that that's like the weirdest thing. Like, how it's did like, they... How it's did like, they... Uh, it's like if, if the UN just like, oh, we have this new system in place, the, uh, the... The uh, eradication of nuclear weapons pact. Whenever someone shoots a nuclear weapon or a nuke, whatever, at another country, it will it will dissipate. And then they shoot one, and then it doesn't, and then it kills. And they're like, "Oh, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta upgrade." I'm like, "You mean you you gotta make them? You didn't do shit." <laughs> like seriously. <laughs> yeah. Oh, is your commanding officer? Wait, is your ex XO's commanding officer right? Is it because you said XO with an X? Yeah, no, no, but like XO is short for something, and I, f I forget what it is in military terms. Okay. Well, anyway. Oh, uh, okay, yep. The experiment's simple. Just fight against this. The rest of us have the complex part, since we have to measure it. Mr. Sabanachi made a deal. With the military. Why are you doing that? It's like it's <laughs> same thing. It's same thing with the with the Pokemon stars. You gotta you, it's like you gotta do something with something new. You gotta well, throw a spin on it. I'm like, well, why? Like Pokemon stars was well, kind of just like well, it just kind of had to. Had it's, to gonna be like a, it's gonna be like it's gonna be a joke. Like I, I I think I've done that like on reaction <laughs> with friends, and they're like, what the fuck's wrong with you? <laughs> And I'm like, oh yeah, this only works with like, me and, and Don. Yeah, well, you know, res some things from like Resident Evil you just can't get rid of. Ouch! Wow, way up here, huh? Okay, uh, can I attack now? Okay. So all I'm supposed to do is just beat this thing? Yeah. With your sword. I just have to beat it. The sword comes later. Can I? All I have to do, all I have to do probably is just do a last hit. You know how like you want to get loot in a, in a raid? You yeah. Get, you just do a last hit. So you gotta beat it. Yeah, I'm gonna beat it and then last hit it with a sword. <laughs> I don't know. If you're clicking on what I'm trying to say here. <laughs> eh. Look at how efficient this is. I think. How much damage you do? I don't know. Oh, 144, 14, yeah, it's probably better to just do you know, it. Since I do like, oh my god, please. Please decide to have a physical barrier. Uh, anyways, while I'm just slashing away at this for no reason, um... Yeah, the Nintendo Direct was, uh, rather, um... New. New. I did not expect, uh... Like the surprising thing, do well, Doom was kind of a surprise. Wolfenstein 2 was a very big surprise. I was okay. I was, I was, I, I was like delighted with a Wolfenstein. I didn't expect it to be two. I thought they were gonna like, oh yeah, we can't. Uh, we're, we're just gonna go. We're gonna go one, and then later on you get two. Um, no, they're, they're going for they're going for your newest one, which is very surprising for me. Yeah, I did not think that they were. I did not think Bethesda had that. Wait, it was Bethesda. Right? Uh, yeah. I guess because they had that long relationship with Nintendo, and they're like, oh, okay, we'll give you a shot. But I mean, still, like, I didn't think they'd be that like willing to, oh, that willing to put a new title on the Switch. That's Quidditch. that's what really like gets me. Because I mean, usually. Usually North American companies are, or at least yeah, North American developers are very like, how do I put it? They're very conserv you yeah, conser conservative. Yeah, conservative. They're very conservative with uh, how they manage their IPs. So to see it, like, to see it there, on like on a on a new platform that yes is popular, but is also kind of kind of sold out, kind of, mm. um, is really strange. We're just gonna round you. So, uh, but I didn't. I don't know why it, 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 it hasn't clicked for me until now. But like, I find it how annoying you have to go. Like, yeah, you, you kind of have to go in, in uh, in another menu in order to do like these skills. Yeah. Um. I don't know. It, that, it, like, it, it didn't click until now for some reason. I just don't know why. Like, tails. Tails did it very nicely. Did, did not kill him yet? No, you didn't. That now. Um, well, actually, I wanted to mention this, but especially now that we're this far, in, I guess if, if, if I call this far, <laughs> um, um, sure. Which is like the way this game is designed, and 
like my thoughts my thoughts about this game is that um well my thoughts about this game is that like it's a good game and it is a good system mm -hmm. in, in a good mechanic in the game the real like i guess the real problem lies in like uh i guess time like why sega chose to make this part of the valkyrie universe instead of making a new ip uh because uh, because of like you know the valkyria valkyria Revol sorry the valkyria chronicles universe is pretty much um hey we're a strategy game but we're we're a little more real time and we do the combination of the two which makes us very interesting so like having this kind of gameplay which makes it feel like um makes it feel like an mmorpg mm. or or like xenoblade uh, or sorry, a less, a more passive Xenoblade. This makes it feel very weird. To me, it's just like, uh, like I wouldn't be, like I don't wanna, I don't wanna, I don't wanna shit on them. But like at this rate, if it's gonna be like this, like I'm expecting like the next installment to be like, uh, so a different timeline, whatever, blah blah blah. You mean and if then, there's a next installment. If there's a next installment, and they like, yeah, you know what? Why not do more of this? And but the thing is that they don't do this. Like, imagine, like, the next thing would be, like, a uh, third-person shooter. That's... Well, okay, because, mind you, though, like, VC1, uh, and, well, actually, all the VCs up until this point, were, like, third-person shooters in a way, but it just wasn't... It just wasn't active. It was turn-based. Yeah, that's what I mean. Like, there's gonna be an actual active uh, uh, sh shooter. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't know. I could see it way better in... Like, just looking at this, like, you'd expect, yeah, sure, why not just be a shooter in general? Like, it's, like, right now, we're looking right at it as a shooter. Right? Yeah. But, like, they just didn't do... But I guess, you know, I guess that they, they tried to do a strategy, a, a stratagem style uh, muso. Well, yeah, actually, it is kind of like a strategy muso. Yeah, they, yeah, they, they went for strategy muso, but, like, it, but, um... I, they could have, they also could. I wouldn't be surprised in the same in the same way. They just took this and made it as a third, actual like third person shooter slash. Not boot. Don't want to say you know, some you know, like, you know, like a shooter slash like uh thing. You know, it doesn't have to be like guns. It be like sword. Uh, so more hack and weapon. slash than it is just. Yeah, but like they're gonna throw. Yeah, they're gonna throw that and then just uh, add the. Well, actually, no, I don't know if they can afford a server. You know what? They could afford a server. Well, you know, that go in multiplayer if they wanted to, if they were to do that. It just depends on how much money, uh, money, uh, Sonic rakes in. <laughs> Mania or Forces? Because, like, honestly, like, no honestly, offense to- both. <laughs> the, no offense, like, Mania brought up the money, I'm scared that Forces might, <laughs> might have break even. <laughs> That's my problem. <laughs> yeah, the, the, uh, eternal Sega dilemma. <laughs> Where they just don't know what to do with their main mascot. <laughs> like, come on, take they're doing a good move right now, where they're gonna. So they're making uh, they're, they're, they're one of their moves, one of the moves that they're gonna pull off of the, the biggest move is that they're actually gonna be putting out a physical, a physical uh, copy of uh, Project Diva X. Mm -hmm. the X is not well, either way, having a physical. Wait, you mean in North America or yeah, just in North America? America. Okay. Cause like, that's actually really smart. Cause like, you know what I'm talking about. Uh, X is the one where it's just like, it's, mixed up. it's like, it's the arcade one, but like, as a console. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's what, that's what I'm talking about. They, they, they finally like, okay, you know what? Yeah, we gave you, we gave you like, two songs for free, and then the rest is just to download the rest. Now they're just like, okay, here's a physical disc, and just uh, have everything. But the thing for me is just like, it's you know, like, yay! But at the same time, I'm like, I'm slowly getting into the, into the, into, uh, actually owning stuff digitally. Just ever so slightly. It's only like games like, um, I can imagine me not playing in the future, in, in, the, in the future that I, I buy physical just for like a trade. Just for the trade in values, basically. But yeah, this is, uh, like games like games that I would actually like, oh, okay, I'm gonna keep this. I, I'm gonna keep it for a while. I'm just gonna, I'd actually, uh, I'd actually buy it. And mm. on digital, so it's like to be playing without this, and it, so I don't have to sell it. Mm. Well, I would be, able to, I, I would have that thing to sell. Well, okay. Well, well, I wish we could have a longer discussion about like why, you, why, whether you should keep things physical or digital, because that is a whole debate on its own. 
Um, it would be lovely if I could do it on a podcast, I don't know, on a Saturday. That would be lovely, too. <laughs> yeah, well, uh, I know, scheduling and stuff, yeah. <sighs> um... Okay, you, you know what, well, while well, 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 we're in the weeds right here, why... Just tell me why. Why generally? Why Sunday generally? Oh, uh, um, mainly... Honestly, it's, um... It's just too taxing for me. <laughs> uh Uh... Cause I'm usually the one directing the podcast. And like if it's if it's transportation, I will be the one to be. I'll be the friggin' solution if I have to. No, no, it's not transportation. It's honestly like how it's like Jamal can't make it because he can't drive to Mississauga. I'm like I will drive. It's actually honestly, it's just because like um it's like it's the other thing is that like Saturdays is. Usually occupied for like for most people for the, for everybody else. The reason why we record this on like on the days we do mainly because of again your your work schedule. Yeah. So that that's why that's why we do the things the way we do. Um, also, that's on you too now. Yeah. Like you can't. Yeah. What? 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 Yeah. You got me to shock. Yeah. It's, it, you your schedule too. Yeah, I, no, yeah, but I'm, I'm, I'm managing my time in a way so that like, I, I can prioritize this. Yeah. Uh, okay, okay. Not to show off what we, what we do, uh -huh. but when do you guys record on Sundays? Uh, when? Yeah. Usually around like 7 p.m. <sighs> yeah, that's the, uh, yeah. Because, you know, because... People are busy on weekends. So I'm gonna save right now because that was a stupid mission. Hey, we get shiny... No, actually, we always have shiny blades. That also wasn't a very good mission, so I guess I'm gonna have to do the next one since that one didn't really make a lot of sense. You know, how about we change it to this? How about you just play the game we always, and I just talk to you? <laughs> please. Uh, uh, yeah, you know what? I mean, if you if you feel like it, yeah. Yeah, we could do please, that. Please, please. No offense, but please.